Hi everybody, it's Kathy from Kathy's Cards. I'm here to share a project with you. This was a teapot and I had gotten this um, from one of the auctions that were online. I think it's Cola Crafts, uh, Jen from Cola Crafts. And this is how it looked. This is how I got it. It's just bare uh, chipboard. And it's not like each piece is whole. There's like separate pieces here. Um, like this piece here actually goes there. So it's a little harder um, to kind of deal with than having four full um, pieces of uh, a teapot. But I still made it work. So I want to share with you what I did end up doing with it. I'll put that over on the side. And here it is here. I put tea time on that. And then over here I have hanging. Let's see if you can see it. This is actually um, the top piece here. Let's see if I can get it up close. This is actually a Saworski um, uh, piece that I got. And it has a stone in the middle. And it's for, um, you know, hanging things from. So what I did is I got some teapots, a saucer, and a cup. And I have that hanging from here. And I have that on there. And then over here, I did one of the metal pieces um, that will hold the book together. And like I said, it's a little harder because this thing is in pieces. But, um, but I think it's, it'll still work. So anyways, the first page is actually, see it's separate um, from here. Um, the first page here, I had tea time. And I put the little flowers and I put the pink trim. I also put some paper uh, that I got from one of my paper packs. I don't remember right now. And I just cut out the part, the flower part, because I thought it would go well. And it had the color that would match the flowers. Then I put a angel, of course. Got to have an angel. And then I put this trim uh, that I got from AliExpress. I put this trim on every one. So then you flip it over. And here, move my mouse so I don't disconnect us. Uh, like I said, because you don't always have full pieces, this is a half. Um, you can't put as much in. But what I did is I made some pockets here. And I actually made these out of bands that I got at the Dollar Tree. And I cut it to fit that. And inside here, um, I printed out these Do Come For Tea. Um, I got these off of Esty. Esty. And, um, and inside, I got a Velcro, and inside there's a tea bag. So I put the Velcro there, and I have that in there. So, like I said, if they don't like that tea, they can put whatever tea they'd like. Again, I put, you know, some embellishments, some resin pieces around here, too. Um, I was just kind of looking with the pink and the kind of the blue-green. I'm kind of going with that. And then this top here that it showed like actually being on here, you had to actually paste it on the next one um, so it would look like when it's put together that it goes together like that. Like I said, it's like a little puzzle the way they made this one. So I had to end up gluing this on the next page. And then I put this uh, trim all around uh, for the handle on the teapots. And then here I have like a clock. It says pot of tea, and then this here says um, tea time, and again I have this trim, and then up here is another trim that I had that I used for the top, and I put a flower and a stone, and then onto the next page, I used uh, a kind of a green blue, same thing, I used the headbands from Dollar Tree, and I put that on here, and again I found a wooden time piece. And then I put like a purse and a flower, um, butterfly. And then here on the page it says tea makes everything better. And then inside I found these kind of old fashioned pictures with the little girls and it says time for tea. Same here, time for tea, but it's a different picture. And then this says tea time. It's one of those old fashioned uh, uh, pictures. It says Earl Grey advertisement. Oblong tea herbal teas and again um, whoever gets this can put whatever they want they can add to it 
and then over here now this one is a half a one <laughs> and um, again I couldn't put as much on it but I put the two little girls and it says T for two which I thought were really cute you can see it up close and I put a trim here and then with the trim oh, got a little glue for the trim I put some uh, green pearls and that says roses and this also says time for tea and then over this way there we go. this one here this back here um, I put another one of those bands to make pockets and this one here I did another um, tea bag holder this one says my cup runneth over and inside is the uh, tea bag so I put that in there like I said with it being a smaller space I couldn't put as much in as I would have liked but I figured the next person that gets it they can put in like whatever they'd like and then I put my favorite little uh, flower smiley flowers I always like them and then I put a little wooden heart and I put a pink rose with that and then here this is the last part of it. Um, it says you and me. And then I found this real nice trim that I had in my stuff. And it went with the colors perfectly. You can see it here. Oh, the lighting's a little. <laughs> there we go. Um, so I put that there because I really like that. And I put all the trim around. And again, I put the uh, little tea things here. Then for the back, this is the back, and it says, T is always a good idea. So that was that. And I think somebody's coming. Hang on. Okay. Um, anyways, um, this is the back of the uh, book, of the T book. And I put more of that lovely trim on there in here so like I said it's, it's just a small little chipboard book but it was a lot of fun to do I think it will look cute hanging up so let me know what you think ladies and I'll be talking to you real soon thanks a lot